Hi, my name is Christopher Hart. I'm an author of many books on how to draw cartoons, figure drawing, manga, etc. Today I'm going to show you how to draw a puppy begging. It's an adorable little pose. So let's start with a blue pencil so we can do everything roughly and then we'll finish it up in a regular pencil. But we'll get the pose first. Now, when a dog is begging, he's looking upward. So what do we, we do? We start with a circle for the skull, but then we bring the snout up. See that? So now he's looking this way already. You have him looking up here, like so. Now, a small snout, because he's a puppy, and puppies have small snouts, and at least in cartoons, and they, ha they, they do actually, but in cartoons too, and a big top of the head. We'll bring this neck down along a, a sleek line. Bring this part of the neck down. Now look, here's something interesting. The back is, on, when the dog sits, the back is always kind of humped. It doesn't go in and out, as you might expect. It's always humped. So now let's bring the shoulder up. He's going to be supporting his weight here with this little, cute little paw. And with a, with a puppy, we don't really make uh, distinguish the paw that much from the, the arm. We make it all kind of chubby. Now, this is his elbow. So his elbow is on the other side in the same position. So we don't see much of the bend. We really basically see the forearm coming out, and we flop the paw over like this. See that? All right, so let's bring this down and bring, bring his bent leg here. We're going to overlap it. Here's his foot down below, and the tail goes up, which means as his head comes up, Here's the ear, the ear goes down. Eye line is right on the top of the muzzle. So we're gonna have him looking up. Little nose here. Like that. And we're gonna clean all this stuff up. A little bit of fur over here. Just getting the position right. Okay, are you ready for, well, let me just make this a little more tilted back like this. I'm going to color that in because I like the blue eye. Okay. Let's use the black pencil and get started. Now we're going to finish up and polish this. Like so. Add some boldness. Some eyelashes. And use the uh, eyebrow way up high like this to show a little insecurity. Some back to. Bring the nose out, nice and short. Not a big nose, really. Some whiskers. We'll bring the head up high. We'll flop something over here. Now the back of the head is what really makes him very cute. And most people don't realize that that's got to be exaggerated. There's a little bit of fuzz and the ear hangs down. Gravity. Show the gravity on that. Just hang it straight down. Yes, it does cover up some of the rest of the drawing, but that's what happens. Here's the collar. We'll darken that so it looks different from the shading on the ear. Medallion. Here's the chest. Here's the front leg. We'll give him a little marking back here. And the tail. And we'll give him a little another marking back here.
flapping the paw over. We can give him a little bit of mouth here if you want to. Make that a little larger. And a little bit of a, a, a cheek area. And there you go. There is your dog in a begging position. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, please subscribe to my channel and I hope you share this with someone. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye. And I'm the author of many popular how to draw books on everything from cartooning to manga. I upload new videos each week, so please subscribe and enjoy.